All right. Uh, welcome everyone to uh, to this podcast. <laughs> this podcast. It's, uh, it's, the, it's the first podcast I'm, I'm doing uh, with visuals, and you know some people can't quite have the visuals, can they? The silliness has begun already. But uh, I have two people uh, I really appreciate being here with me today. I've got Gabby G and Camille K. You don't need to know their surnames. <laughs> 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 I'm going to pronounce names. No, I can say your surname. You told me in high school, do you remember? You know I still can't say it. Was. <laughs> oh, but uh, yeah, we're doing, we're doing this podcast with visuals. So uh, I hope you enjoy. And uh, the first topic I wanted to discuss is... Uh, Are we not even going like, to say a little bit about ourselves? Actually, go on. Uh, say I mean, a bit about yeah, 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 Go on, go on. That's unfair. Um... Yeah, my name's Camille. I'm a uh, decor student from Birmingham. Yeah. I live in Manchester. Oh, calm down, bro. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> she was so excited. Look at the background. Like, you're like the like morally challenging, no, not challenging one. Do you know what I mean? Like, you can talk more about ethics mm-hmm. and like the law and things like that, and I'm just yeah. supposed to both be more law. passionate about. Yeah, I do law and criminology. Don't forget criminology. Oh, okay. What's what was criminology? Study of crime. Oh, okay. Okay. Can you help me? Can you help me commit murder? <laughs> Yo, don't, you don't need to worry about what that comments you just made there. And uh, you know, if you've never listened to any of my things before, and this is the first time you come upon me, I'm William. I go to Cassini. Oh! What you said it? I linguistics with French. Is it French? That's the one. Yeah, it's me French. Tout le monde veut toujours que je parle. La tête. Ah bon? Ah bon? Un stylo. Mais. Un stylo? Un stylo. Un ouais. stylo. La tête. La tête. All right then. Without further ado, let's 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 get into it. But, but, you know, I've got I've, there's there's two people here who have strong opinions. I say so. Yeah. We'll discuss a strong issue yeah. of morals. And this issue came to me not long ago when a friend of mine. It was it was quite disappointed in me by a, a behavior of mine, and w- the way that I had. Just uh, give the story. Don't don't just give the background. Give the story. Tell what happened. Story time. No sugar coating. Tell us what happened, <sighs> and we can dissect the story. And then okay. you can. Do you want him to out himself? Okay. Yeah, yeah, he wants to out because he's the one who brought the topic. He wants us to talk about what's morally right. Bring it. And he obviously thinks he's right. So let's talk about. It. Well. Essentially, what I think is morals are situational, and the uh, the story behind the story that uh, Camille is alluding to here is uh, wh- when I was in Liverpool not too long ago. Oh, my city. Her city. I, uh, you know, the, I, I I helped myself to a bakery item. In in in. Turn. You do that all the time. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Oh, was that not supposed to say? Well, no, her no, argument no, is going to no, come up. No, my argument isn't going to come up. Just you did it in Tesco as well. <laughs> yes. Tesco, that's even worse. How could that you? Give me? No, no, no. Just because I do it doesn't mean I think it's right. I know it's wrong. The thing is, he's doing it and he's making himself seem like it's right. He's like, no, 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 they're not going to miss the money, blah, blah, blah. They're not. They're not. <laughs> they're not like, look, here's the situation with you guys. I took a 50p a croissant of how much, how much it is <laughs> from Lidl. And Lidl make millions of croissants a day the they, thing, they no, throw so many in the bin as well like, I'm not, they're not going to miss that one croissant that right, I, I took right. and you know my, the, my friend she's actually right here I'm not going to say name she got angry because she was saying that stealing is wrong it and, is and well me personally I believe that morals is situation as in a different context makes the exact same thing either more or less but just to make it clear, Perfect. stealing isn't okay under any circumstances. Just because you're stealing a 90p, 60p for your kids. <laughs> Pastry doesn't make it okay. Like, full stop is wrong. No, That's it does. Cool. In that situation, I think, it's, I think people think it's not wrong because it doesn't have harmful effects. Uh, so if, if you stole from, like, an but old if you baby, got caught, No, but if you got caught, you still... No, nah, they don't send you to prison for 90p croissants. Me. Okay, wait, wait. Did you pay for 5p bags? That's stealing. It is. And I do, that's actually against the law, you know. Exactly, see? Um, it's still against the law. So, but I refuse to pay for a bag. No, I refuse to pay for a bag too, but it's still wrong. You can't be like, oh, 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 oh. the moral and 
because of situation. No, 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 no. Yeah, no, let me give you. I think it's wrong. No, I think it's wrong because first of all, you harm the environment. Like think about the poor environment. You could have used your recycle bag. You could have taken a reusable bag, brought it from home. Why did you have to buy that bag, Eva? You got one back right. home. You got. You don't. <laughs> You know, under your cupboard, under that specific cupboard, you've got a bag of bags. Exactly, you've got a bag full of bags, full of bags. You could have just gotten them. Then I'm not throwing them away, so I'm not harming the environment. Are you not throwing that plastic bag that you got away, though? Like, no, put it, it in the bag of the bags, isn't it? Are you sure? I'm sure. Mm-hmm. No, I, I'm just saying, I've got too many bags. Ooh, wow. Because I always forget my bags. Because I always go shopping when I don't even plan to. It'll be like my friends will be like, oh, I'm picking up certain bars since I'm like, oh, say that. Say that, and I'll come with you. Now, but what I. My, my rebuttal to Marl's main situation is that uh, <coughs> Take for instance, nudity oh, hell You know, no. most of the time, nudity <laughs> <laughs> I can already see the reach that you're going to do It's, it's, it's not a reach And I'll make it your Yeah, nudity for instance, in day to day life is, 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 you know, outside of your house, nudity is not acceptable Like, you can't go down a high street naked Is that illegal, by the way? Yeah However, if you're at a Public. beach, if you're at a beach, nudity is almost encouraged, you know. No, I went to the beach in Spain and I just saw bare tits. I was a bit scared. Spain, what did you just lie out there? I was thinking. You see, but that's like, it's I was like, exactly what's happening? I'm like, too young. Yeah, <laughs> but at the end of the day, it's just breath. But like, I'm like, I'm thinking, whoa. Like, I know they're yours. Like, I'm not trying to look. I promise I'm not looking. But <laughs> like, I saw a grand as well. Is there something? I was like. I mean, I don't think they're bothered if you look at no, I don't think they have because the other day you're the one who showed it to me. It's mm. not like I went searching. Do you know what I mean? Like, dude, we're just there. You're just there? Yeah. No, right, really. so what's your story? What's your point about you? Yeah. No, but my point is that it's the exact same behaviour as in the nudity, but the different situations make it approve. Appro- That's not really morals, though. It's not like. It's not morals in terms of like, evil and um, not if evil. If your morals are like, oh, I don't like to show like, my body and stuff, right. you're at the beach. Without bra, well, not a bra, but a bikini top. Then you can't be saying that you don't like to show your body, do you? <laughs> <laughs> because if I don't like to show my body, I won't do it just because I'm at the beach. You know See, what I mean? the way I see morals is like, obviously, you have like the set foundation morals. Yeah. But I do think, like, until you face a certain situation, you don't know how you're going to respond. Yeah. So, like, a lot of people say, like, abortion is really, really wrong. And then, yeah. But then yeah, imagine yeah. having, like, getting pregnant at this age. What are, what are the chances that Especially you're Especially the circumstances that you've got exactly. pregnant as well. So, like, I feel like, yeah, I'm shouting, abortion is <coughs> wrong and shit. But if I get pregnant now, yeah. I'll be quiet. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You're not listening. Exactly. <laughs> you you go you pay a visit to the clinic and you you move on. Oh. No, but either way, yeah, always have sex protected, you guys. Oh, don't have sex for marriage. Don't have sex for Do whatever you want, but you know. Oh, you don't have sex. No, yeah, don't have sex. Try what? That's a giant mascot. Celibacy. Same, I'm celibate. So oh, like, okay. Yeah. I promise. I've, yeah. I've, I've <laughs> decided to. Today! <laughs> <laughs> right now, as of this moment. No, I've, I've, I've just, you know, I've, I've. I mean, there's no judgment here, but if you decided today, did you really decide? Oh, it's just because of the situation that you'd be most changed because of the situation, yeah. No, I just, you know, I think everyone should focus on making themselves the best celibate. Uh, them they can be first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is, but that's not the question. When did you decide? But I'm saying. Yeah. Well, I guess now. technically <laughs> right now. <laughs> but that's that's because I was surrounded by these. Really. Is it? Let's get too much far. Did your morals get swayed? They got, see that? Yeah, does, does, does this often happen with your friends? Like, I'm just wondering, like, for bad things as well, bad behavior. Well, peer pressure is a real thing. You Especially for you, it seems. Not necessarily, it depends what it is. Sometimes, you know, but that's what everyone does. Like, say you're like, nah, I'm not going out today, I'm staying in, I'm tired, blah, blah, blah. But then all your girls are going out. I'll stay on. Seriously? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I don't know, no, the thing is, like, I truly believe if you don't want to do something, you will not do you it. You will not do it. You won't. I'm sorry, if you're tired as well, you know, you've got a hard time. So you don't think people your... can be convinced? No, I definitely think they I can do. definitely be convinced. But then I feel like. Be convinced, like, yourself. <laughs> Trust me. That 400 pounds on the of us but yeah, I do feel like you can definitely. I feel like there's always a small part of you that will want to do it. Yeah. That's and true. you just need the right people to bring, to bring it out of you or to push it out of you. 100%. So I feel like people who are screaming, okay, me for example, okay. <coughs> I'll never drink. 
And they're like, oh my god, I was there for the lunch. <laughs> Literally, I'm never going to get drunk. Two months later, I'll throw it up. <laughs> oh, god. <laughs> no, literally in college, I was like, I actually just don't understand people who get drunk. Like, what are they don't doing with their life? <laughs> so what... A few moments later. Speaking of guys, there's a, there's a, there's a pressing issue I need to address. Right. You Your stinginess. Too. Not my stinginess, but... You, you guys told me, before we started recording, they were saying if a guy doesn't pay for, for a first date, it's actually a problem. It's not a it's problem. Not a problem. Mm -hmm. No, you're like... Maybe I'm overemphasizing. Yeah, yeah that's what it is. But it was more or less, it's not good basically if you don't you're pay You're just going to like, look at him sideways. But it's not like... To so be fair, if I was being honest, I wouldn't like... I don't know, like, I was just think... I just think if you I pay, pay, you don't rate me. Yeah, exactly. That's, that's what, what I was doing. Doing. If you pay, I'm like, right, mm. like, sweet one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's sweet one. And then if you don't, I was thinking, like, why you don't rate me? Yeah. Like, realistically, if you're going on a first date, like, mm. especially if you ask me. more than, like, what, 30 pounds? 35? Like, for both of you, it's like, I don't know where you're going, like, Nando's. Just, listen, uh, 20 pounds? Yeah. Simple. Don't yeah. Yeah. That's what I was about to say. That's what I was about to say. I'm not going to Basically, dates are expensive, and if you're going on a date and you don't have the money, why are you going on a date? Like, I'm not saying like. Nah, do you hear that? If voice? you don't have the means. If you don't have money, you can't have the <laughs> No, no, no. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying. saying. If you don't have the means to go on a date, there's no point in trying to impress a girl by trying to go somewhere very expensive. If you don't have the money, go for coffee. The thing is, even like, like three pounds. I don't think dates don't really matter as long as you're with the right person. Nah, I'm saying. We can go to like a fancy restaurant and have the shittest time yeah, ever. Because 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 like, the what, if, what if the date was like? KFC. KFC, mm, we can't accept that. I'm you don't accept that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. She go KFC for first. The thing yeah. is though, like, that's not a date for me. I wouldn't pass it as like a date. No, that's just meeting up. Like, that's like, just getting like, that's like, just like, 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 like but I'm cool with them. Yeah, yeah, okay, I'm, I'm gonna see you as a friend. But it depends the con but why would you be talking to me? I'll take you to KFC. The kind of wants to KFC is shopping. We'll go KFC and enjoy ourselves. So like, no, Gabby, just listen. So you actually planned this, like, Ooh, right? <laughs> Let's meet at seven o'clock. I think we need to pause it. No, that's fine. Did the light no, change? Look. Uh, oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, oh, so like, like, the date's gone amazing. You've enjoyed her company. You like her. her. You like her. You you've think like her. you're even gonna like suggest to go out another time mm -hmm. next week? You've already set the date. Now that the man comes, oh like. Are you guys splitting it or? We're splitting it. And we're splitting it because <laughs> this this first date, it's, a, it's about us getting to know each other. It's, yeah. it's not about anyone trying to flex their wallets in anyone's face. Well, I think it's about it's not about about wallet. Wallet. I think it's just like a nice thing to do. It's like, just a nice gesture. Like a why, 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 do you, why can't I feel like a little princess? Because <laughs> <laughs> you're not a princess. Why not? Yeah, but did you not ask her out? Thank you. No, thank you. you. What, that's the thing as well. The only reason I asked her out is because she wouldn't ask me out. That's the nah, problem. No, Gabby wouldn't ask you. I'm not trying to say anything, I'm just saying like, well, that. Honestly, that. Saying, I'm not a fool, but I don't think it's a big deal like, oh, do you want to grab some food? Yeah, yeah, yeah. cool, I'm down. Like, shit, it's not that deep, you know. Oh, for the first date? I'll yeah. never ask for the first date. <laughs> See, that's what my point is. That, the only reason I would have asked that is because they wouldn't have. We and have someone had to. Because otherwise they would never have would it? But, uh, That's true, but if you're asking, doesn't that mean you want to go as well? Yeah, but it's because you won't ask that I'm asking. No, it's not. not because, because you want to go. I want to go, but I would not ask if I didn't think you don't want to go. So, and I'm asking because you won't. So it's just because you're such a kind person? Not because I'm such a kind person, it's because the date will not happen if I'm not asking. Right. That's what you guys are So how would you not pay for her? So make the day kind Maybe of Right now, my, my mindset's not very romantic. I don't so. see. It's been like that since my mindset. You've always stood by this. You never pay for the girl the first day. It's because of <laughs> 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 Edit that shit out. No, What's well, that? yeah, the first day I ever went on, <laughs> the, the girl that I was with, I, I, I offered to pay for, for the dessert that we had, and she was adamant that she's paying herself. This dessert? And I was like. <laughs> see, I don't tell people like that. I'll never argue with you if you're I would never. The thing is, I'm friend, literally insisting. My little you know? group, my little cousin, anyone, I'm never arguing with you. Yeah, if you, you want to pay, pay. I was I like, I literally oh, insisted. Now. I was like, let me pay. And she was like, no, 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 no. And I was like, you know what? Come. And plus, why can't you pay on the first day? I'll pay on the second. No, but why can't you? What, what is it about the first date 
There's right no inside way that you can't. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. But like. <laughs> Okay, this might be a really controversial that. statement to make, but I don't think men and women are equal. I just think yeah, there should be that, there's different equity. Roles. There should be equity, not equality. Because exactly. at the end of the day, we are We're different. different. Yeah. We are like that's yeah, yeah, the babies yeah, are. I just think sometimes you just need to accept that and realize that, like, yeah. as a man, I, I do like that traditional shit. Like, I, <laughs> <mean, laughs> I do. I do. I'm not. No, but, but, yeah, but here's the thing, though. How far to should you like it? Like, what if now we get married? I'm like, okay, raise our kids. And I'm just gonna go work. No, I don't. Are you mad? No, see, that's the thing. Like, no, 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 you like traditional, but you're not traditional when it works for you, man. No, but there's a difference because I want to do. Eat, we can both do part time. Why can't we both raise our kids? Like, my kid's gonna think, nah, where's daddy? He's up there. I make this kid by myself. Exactly. Like, you need to, you need to be present in the kid's life. That's different. I think even, not like, even for me, but for the child itself. Exactly. Like, the child needs a father. No, they yeah, you I want to Of course. Like, I think in terms of like equality, it's like rent or whatever people say like some people expect the man to pay like i expect myself to be bringing money into the relationship so therefore yeah, surely no, expect that that should I would be never uh, be paying the full rent the only reason the man would be paying the full rent had a very traditional thing and then yeah. the woman was actually just at home and that's what she did is like she was like a housewife no. then it's no then it's understandable because if you want her to raise the kid where is she going to get this money from? She's going to be a YouTuber. <laughs> Wait, I have a big question. Okay, I know this is just your show, but no, I have no. a big, big question. No. Okay, so a lot, a lot, like, a lot. What am I talking about? Okay, you might use it in this house. Cool, so, um, I've been getting a lot of guys saying to me, mm -hmm. you don't no, want like a bitch. <laughs> Can somebody explain to me what that means? It like, basically means the no, because no, I don't. What does a virgin look like? No. They How are you trying to link me when you have a girlfriend and you made it public that you have a girlfriend? Exactly. So. What do you want me to say? No, I think it's disrespectful the fact that like, you have a girlfriend and you think it's okay to message me. Like, no, it is. You just, you just think I have girlfriends literally. I just think next time screen should send us a girlfriend. No. No, honestly, because then it's like. You're obviously not embarrassing the girlfriend because it's not her fault. Like at the end of the day, now but if you're some girls, some, some, some girls will take it wrong. Some girls and will it take it embarrassing in general. No, it's less embarrassing if she texts her than if she puts it out on her media. To be fair, it's my business. On, yeah, because whatever's going on. I just want to follow you after. Well, then do you know what I think she does now? The girl. Yeah, she does. Honestly, honestly, the way I feel. You don't have any love my business. Yeah. Not even just loyal, it's just not my business. Like, that's your relationship. That's your business. I don't know you, I don't know him. I'm not in your business. See, in this climate, this is why I can't be romantic. Well, Being in a relationship doesn't even mean that much anymore. I think what it depends you? who you're speaking to. No, I know it, it, that, it definitely does go to yeah. that people. There are still lots of people who are like, loyal or whatever, but. You know. It's the kind of. Even even though you are, there'll be guys who know that you're my girlfriend, but they'll still be with you. You know what oh, I mean? Oh, actually, I had one guy at a club. He came up to me, like, trying to meet me, whatever. And he was like, Oh, my God, you know, I have a boyfriend. And he goes, It's 2019. <laughs> exactly. I thought, and the thing is, that's not unreasonable for him to say. I feel like we've, we've reached a natural conclusion. Which is what? <laughs> Which is, if you're broke, you can't date these two girls. <laughs> Actually, wait, let me first say uh, what the people said at the end of the year when they like. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Thanks for listening. Thanks for coming on, you guys. Subscribe the button. What's the thing about the bell? Turn yeah, notifications turn the notifications on. on. Don't know when that's going to be on, but you know. <laughs> we'll be back soon. Once one girl, it, all, it all only takes one girl to oh, be guys a guy yeah. who decided that girl did not break my heart. It only takes one girl. She like she only takes one girl, she, like, she takes one girl to break a guy's heart, and it's all over. It's all. That over. is kind of true. I guess. There you go. Cause um, once one girl cheats on a guy, the guy will never recover the same. I'm telling you now. Oh.